What's good, YouTube? All knowing, all loving, all feeling, all seeing, all powerful. Just damn all everything. That's sexy as hell, host. We are talking about are you having that afternoon crash? The energy is gone. You're hungry and you don't know what to do. You don't know how to change it or you even having these same feelings at nighttime. Well, your favorite form of fat man in America been through all that, baby. And I'm going to tell you what you can do to change it. But first, I got to put on my plus seven glasses of sexy as hell because we working on skilling up this craft, giving you a better informed review and also something better to look at. If you like these glasses, Fermo.com in my video description, get yourself a pair as we're making these life gains. So I told you guys, I kept a notebook of pretty much everything I was doing as I was losing weight from the way I was saving money to the way I was working. All the disciplines in my life came from me getting disciplined in my diet. And so one thing that I always noticed that was an issue for me was, you know, no matter what I did in the morning, I would crash around 3 p.m. at 8 p.m. But what I didn't know was these are the typical symptoms of people that have issues with their insulin. Those are the typical times people have crashes around 4 p.m., around 8 p.m. You start feeling cranky, you're tired. Um, in some cases, you're just very, very irritable. So. What, is, what, what does that come from? It comes from a dip in your insulin. And oftentimes people will mistake that dip in insulin for they wanna just go eat whatever. They wanna go load up on sugar and you get a little boost for a little while but then you immediately kinda of have that crash again because just getting a sugar boost doesn't mean that you stabilize your insulin the way you need to stabilize your insulin. And sometimes you have these weird cravings too. You want salty and crunchy, especially at nighttime. Man, I was I guilty of wanting salty and crunchy at nighttime. And that's just because I wasn't controlling my insulin properly. It's not necessarily that you're hungry, you just gotta control that insulin. And so how do you fix that? How do you make sure that by the afternoon and end of the day, you don't get that crash? And I'm gonna tell you two ways that I've done that. So to handle the 4 p.m. crash, what I would do I would eat a meal that has a you know, moderate amount of protein, some vegetables, because you want those minerals. Those minerals are gonna help satisfy that insulin drop that you have. And I would also have increased my fats. I would figure out how much fat I would need so that I wouldn't have that drop. And I would also do apple cider vinegar. If you guys aren't on apple cider vinegar, get you some, but make sure it's got the mother. I'll do a video on some of the benefits of apple cider vinegar later, but it really, really helps. So I'll get some healthy protein, eat some spinach, some big bowl of vegetables for minerals, and I will increase my healthy fat with apple cider vinegar, and I started getting through that crash, not a problem. But then I got to my second problem, which was at nighttime, I just wanted to snack on something salty and crunchy. So how would I do that, get through that? i just go to bed before it. <laughs> I'm dead serious. I would just go to bed before that. And sometimes if I had that afternoon crash and I had a quick little 15 minutes, I would take a nap. Taking a nap can help you overcome that for sure. You know, I know a lot of guys that are taking naps in the afternoon and I have clients that I've said, take a nap. If you could take a 15 minute nap, your day allows you to do that, do that. And that's helped them break it. But ultimately, you want to increase the amount of healthy fats, increase the amount of great vegetables that you have for the mineral support, add some apple cider vinegar, and make sure you're staying into your protein regimen for the day and include protein in that meal beforehand too. All these things will help stabilize your blood sugar so that you don't have that crash and so that you're not having those crazy cravings that might make you derail from your fitness journey. And that's going to do it for this video, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to like my video, comment, and subscribe. If you're still looking for a coach to help you out, you want to get a free meal plan, you want to get a free fitness plan, just go over, join me over there at my Patreon account. I do special things by giving away those type of things to all of my Patreon folks because we're trying to help folks make these life gains in 2018. And until that next sexy as hell video, I'll see you.